Don't get scammed whenever you are buying a car. Here are some tips and tricks to avoid car scams at dealerships. As a new car buyer, it can be very difficult purchasing your first vehicle. It can be very overwhelming whenever you are looking for a vehicle. Whether it's a new or used vehicle, it definitely can have a lot of challenges, especially with a ton of scams nowadays. Unfortunately, there is a lot of dishonest salespeople and dealerships that are trying to take advantage of people whenever they are purchasing their vehicles. But with these tips and tricks, you can avoid it being scammed and try to find the perfect vehicle for you. One of the biggest scams is the bait and switch. This is one of the most common car sales scams out there. The dealership advertises a car at a low price, whether it's a new or used car, and whenever you get there, it's no longer in stock and they claim that it recently sold. Instead, they try to sell you a more expensive model. When you arrive at a dealership and the vehicle that you wanted is not there or the price is not as advertised, to me it's just time to walk away. If they're doing the bait and switch, who knows what else the dealership is going to try to do. Be aware of high pressure sale tactics. If a salesperson is pushing you to make a quick decision or is offering a deal that seems way too good to be true, be very skeptical. Take your time to think the purchase through and don't feel pressured to make a decision right away. Another way that car dealerships try to get more money out of you is to try to add unnecessary add-ons. For example, they might try to sell you an extended warranty that you don't really need. To avoid this scam, do your research prior to arriving at the dealership. Know what features that you want on your next vehicle and know what that dealership offers as far as warranty and other add-ons that you know you will not want ahead of time. So whenever you get there, you can just tell them no straight out and avoid them trying to scam you. Always read the fine print. Never sign any paperwork until you've read through it thoroughly and know what you're agreeing to. Look out for hidden fees, extended warranties, and other add-ons that can significantly increase the overall cost of the vehicle. One big add-on that they do try to add other than the extended warranty is they try to add on a minimum of 10 years of oil changes, which they claim is free, but they're adding about two to $3,000 on top of your purchase price, but they also don't have the right brands and I only need to get an oil change a minimum 10 to 15,000 kilometers and they want to do one every 3,000 kilometers. So that is why it costs so much more getting it done at the dealership. So you actually would be saving money going and getting your oil changes done elsewhere. Make sure that you always trust your instincts. If something doesn't feel right, don't be afraid to walk away. It's always better to lose out on a deal than get stuck with a lemon or getting taken advantage of by a dishonest salesperson. My biggest tips will always be do your research, negotiate everything, and don't be afraid to walk away if you're not getting a fair deal. Remember, buying a vehicle is a big investment. So take your time and make sure that you're making the right choice. Vehicles aren't cheap and you definitely want to make sure you're picking the right one for you regardless of where you're going to purchase it. Always keep these scams in mind that dealerships do try to use these tactics. As long as you're going to the dealership and you know the price that you want to pay for your next vehicle, you know the add-ons that you want for your vehicle, what features it wants, and what you really need in your next vehicle, you should be fine going to the dealership and not getting taken advantage of. By following these tips, you'll be better equipped to avoid car dealership scams and hopefully find your next vehicle. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys in the next one. Please take care. Peace.